following my own sort of path of having uh, run away to the far corners of the earth to photograph, you know, something, uh, something that I didn't know and was curious about or whatever. Uh, um, that journey has sort of brought me full circle back to home, back to my own life and, um, and having a child. Uh, it was a very natural thing for me to sort of kind of look inward and the time of my life, perhaps the age that I'm at. Um, it wasn't, wasn't really a conscious decision to, to decide, okay, now I'm going to photograph this, you know, photograph my family. It just sort of started happening. And, uh, um, and in no small party, also because there, there just weren't any more jobs uh, with the, yeah. the kind of the, the, the implosion of the publishing industry and, and um, uh, the, the, the economic crash, uh, you know, from one day to the next, being a, a, a photographer who worked primarily on assignment for magazines, uh, and one day there were no more magazine assignments, essentially. Um, so I found myself at home a lot more, too. There's different possibilities, you know, at the same time that, that, that the traditional ways of, of earning a living as a photographer are, are vanishing. Um, new alternative ways to, to market oneself or um, at least get your images out to reach an audience, uh, the, the, there are so many more ways to do that now. Um, and in some ways, I think the possibilities are quite exciting. Um, you know, be it whatever. I, I this year I I, I created my own uh, um, uh, app of my book Capitolio, uh, and that has allowed me to reach an, a far broader audience than I was ever ever able to with with the print version of the book. Even though I still love printed books, and the, and the print version to me is is the the you know the consummate form of that that work. Um, I was uh, I'm able to reach an audience that's that's far far broader uh, with the app, um, and then of course you know there's the internet, there's there's multimedia, there's there's exhibitions, there's there's self uh, a new exciting world of self publishing going on, um, and and a you know photographer now has has sort of this power, uh, we're empowered to to be able to self publish in ways that we never were before, and then. F have platforms to reach an audience with that self-publishing um, and it's in that in many ways it's kind of an exciting new world I, st I still can't get used to calling myself a master in the master class so I don't like using that term actually but um, uh, yeah I, I mean I maybe my role here is is uh, um, to uh, maybe I can offer advice to to the, uh, the next generation um, from my experience uh, um, and uh, yeah and I, I I kind of see the role is and as we were even told here that the it's more of a role of, of a coach so to speak than than actually a, a professor or a teacher and in the way this the thing seems to be structured here also during the master class I actually do I teach a lot of workshops and the 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 structure here has not been one of sort of direct teaching, but but more of a, a mentoring in a way, um, uh, helping photographers the, the, the photographers here um, who are participating, you know, w with editing, um, with uh, helping them find what it is they want to say with their pictures. In terms of the business now of of photography um, and documentary photographers or photojournalists or whatever it's it's changing so quickly right now um, and um, and so profoundly that it, it's hard for me to even know how to articulate that to the young generation of, of what to do because um, I'm not sure sometimes what to do um, but one of the things that I I don't want to discourage photographers but I also want to be um, uh, make them aware of the realities of the difficulties 
At the same time, it's what I've always told students and, and younger photographers is, is you know, to for, forget about the, the profession. Um, don't be don't be caught up with this idea of, of that you're only legitimized as a photographer by you know earning a paycheck with with your camera. It, you've got to find a way to make the pictures that you need to make, um, and perhaps and hopefully the profession will come. But the first thing is the pictures.